all right welcome back everyone uh another update for you guys and as you guys can see it's a crazy day today look at the gain 3100 as you guys seen my last video i think i was around 24 25 000 yeah uh, it's gone up like crazy it's kind of unbelievable right now but today i am up 3100 i'm going to show you guys what happened um let's go through what we do every week here now it's 28 but um okay so the past week up 3800 the past month crazy 68 69 uh three months 10,140 for the year the past year up 9,556 and overall I'm up 9668 so as you guys can see I probably put in right around 20,000 uh, under 20,000 I am at 2976 so what the craziness that's happening I'm sure you guys know a lot of uh, the GameStop uh, talk and the crazy stuff on that I do not have any GameStop here but I will show you guys what I bought and these this is not a dividend company I bought it because I hope why well, I, I thought they were gonna come back and they did uh, this was last week and I uh, my last video you guys can see what I did but um, I purchased AMC Entertainment it's not a dividend I think they do pay dividend but not right now they stopped it since the pandemic AMC Entertainment uh, biggest movie theater company in the US um, okay so I bought 300 shares at the average cost of two dollars and ninety cents and it's taking off today a lot to do with i think reddit wall street bets talks about it uh they did get additional funding this week a couple of days ago so and also the pandemic is kind of hopefully going away you know the vaccines are coming in some movie theaters are opening up at uh, a lower capacity but they're opening up so that's all good news and um, i think there's a lot of hype right now behind this company so be careful if you guys are going to purchase this i am not giving you financial advice as always this is for entertainment only but please be careful on buying these risky companies i think i was lucky enough to buy 300 shares at two dollars and 90 cents i think that was uh right around 800 some dollars but total return it keeps changing 39 almost four thousand dollars uh, which is amazing as you guys can see the volume down there below there's a lot of trading going on right now for this uh, this company so thanks to them I am up also so you guys know I did buy this company I call it bingo because of the ticker uh, but it's bio nano genomics or genomics I don't know how to say that sorry so um, I did buy them I only had a little bit back then I did buy 25 shares at two dollars and nine cents which cost me around 50 bucks i think it was uh this was a while ago i think when did i buy them um yeah back in december almost a month ago and this is not a dividend company uh but they did uh they are kind of taking off so i do have a profit of 241 on them uh these are the only companies that do not pay a dividend that i did purchase um so i did create also if you guys want to make comments down below and, and any suggestions i do have viewer suggestions on companies i am going to look through these and uh, hopefully pick one or two or a few so if you guys um see what the other viewers have suggested in the comments you guys can put your own um they did pick gain gladstone investment and, and these are all dividend companies uh but if you guys suggest anything i will look into it uh pay another dividend i think it's an etf if i'm not mistaken i think it is and uh whatever this one is oh another one okay so this one pays a high dividend i think they'll pay high dividends and just so you guys can see what gamestop is doing another crazy day for gamestop 360 dollars right now it's insane and hopefully it hits a thousand like everybody's talking about for you know a lot of people making a lot of money on this one and uh, a lot of millions of dollars and our hope is hopefully amc takes off that'd be amazing but i think it you know if it hits 20 or even 30 uh, i might consider selling at maybe 25 we'll see 
All right, guys, so let's go over the dividends that have come in. Um, I think the market is somewhat down today. Um, I'm practically up. I think, oh, Tesla is going to have their earnings. Oh, here's another non-dividend company that I own, but that's just Tesla. And um, I think overall I am down if it wasn't for AMC and some of these other ones, um, Tesla and uh, PSEC. Yeah, some of these ones are bringing us up a little bit, but it's not as much as AMC. Even Starbucks is way down. Wow. 6.59 today. What happened? I got to look into this. Might be a buy for later. All right. And um, Kraft Foods is up. Everything else is practically down. PFE. SPHD is up. I wanted to get more SPHD, but I think it's a little high right now. My average cost is 34. Um... All right, so let's look at the dividends that have been coming in. And uh, so not as much money as the AMC has made, but we still have to look at this. So for January, I'll scroll down. Um, I'll go quick. UGI, Iron Mountain, AGNC monthly, store capital, STAG monthly, uh, realty income, which is O monthly. Old Republic, like I said before, paid their special dividend. They do it like once a year, I think. Sometimes it's been done uh, the past three years. So this time they paid a dollar per share, which is awesome. Main, uh, PSEC, uh, Ozark. Is this Bank of Ozark? And uh, ARR is going gonna, is gonna to pay on the 28th. And again, SPHD and NRZ. So next month, as you guys can see, we're going to get some money from uh, our... AT&T and Verizon that you can see there and AbV. All right, so I figured I'd buy another company to increase um, like our monthly, I mean, I'm sorry, our weekly deposit of 100. And I'm going to pick Verizon just to bring our average cost, <clears throat> excuse me, our, our average cost down. We did buy um, six shares, average cost 58.26. So, and they pay a good dividend. They pay 62.7. So, uh, we're going to buy two shares of, uh, of Ryzen so we can bring our average cost down to. All right, there we go. Average cost down 57.72 and we have eight shares. All right, guys. So I wanted to let you know that. Well, first, I wanted to thank you guys for the support. All of the new subscribers. Hopefully we can hit a thousand uh, in the next few months. That's my goal. If not, hopefully by this, sometime this year. Um, let me know what you guys think below. If you guys have any ideas, suggestions, comments, anything, I really appreciate it. I appreciate all the likes. Hit the like if you can. Um, something that you guys don't like, let me know below. I will change it. I'll adjust it all. I'll comment. And remember, this is a, a small account. We started with a few thousand, and I've been putting about a hundred bucks. Uh, a week. There's been a few times that I did put a few thousand here and there when I have the extra money, but I'm putting a hundred bucks a week about purchasing uh, one stock, one company every week. And the goal is to make 100 bucks per month in dividend income. Now, of course, after 100, we're going to hit, you know, 200, 300 and so on. But this is to encourage people that are starting out to invest. And hopefully I am helping people and hopefully you guys can get started on investing. If you guys want to join Robinhood, get a free stock. I will put the link below. So just click on that. It gives me a, me a free stock. It gives you a free stock. So if you guys are new, please, um, I'm not giving you financial advice, but please consider uh, investing in some companies. You know, maybe a solid company that pays you a dividend, makes you a little bit of money. The way I see it is, Every dividend payment I get, it's basically a raise on my paycheck. So if I want to make an extra few dollars a year, whatever I keep buying, for example, like Verizon today, we bought two shares. That's an increase of what about a dollar thirty a year on your income. If you leave it in, just don't touch it. You're gonna make a dollar thirty extra. I'm sorry, not a year. It's more of every uh about two two dollars and forty cents a year because i bought two two shares no oh, hold on a second let me see here i'm sorry 
each share is about 240 a year. So that's an increase of about five bucks a year in my income. So if you think about it that way, every stock, stock you buy, Okay, so I was saying, so every stock you buy is an increase in your salary. That's the way I look at it. So every company that pays a dividend is going to give you an extra uh, increase or bump in your uh, yearly income uh, in dividend. So um, as I said before, guys, I really appreciate all the support. Uh, please subscribe if you haven't. Uh, click the link below for a free stock if you want to join Robinhood. And um, I will talk to you guys next week. Thank you.